Good afternoon from Chile, Frisco, Texas. We're in North Dallas, and we're getting ready for what will be a three days of baseball involving four teams. The venue is Dr. Pepper Ballpark. A lot of this game that we play is about competing, controlling your mind, being mentally tough. Make sure you're ready to go. Bulldog's going to counter with the left-hander. Ethan Small, Ethan has gotten off to a good start this year. Struck out 24 batters and walked no one in 12 innings thus far. Swing and a miss on that changeup. He pulled the string. Strikeout number 25 of the year. Long drive, deep left. Left fielder tracing back and reaches up and can't get the ball. It's over his head. On the warning track, Tanner Allen the third. He's going to head for the plate. He'll score without a play. Round ball down the third base line. That's a fair ball into the corner. That's going to score another run, and Mississippi State takes a 2-0 lead as Foscu delivers. Ball in the air. Center fielder coming in. Diving. Can't make the catch. It rolls away from him. Jones is headed for second base, and he will get there with a double. Pitch is a base hit into left field. He tattoos it, or excuse me, into right field. Tattooed it to the pull side. A stretch in the pitch, and he struck him out on the breaking ball. Barlow gets the job done. Gossett's pitch. And it is hit like a bullet down the line. Fair ball into the left field corner. Foscu is headed for second. It's a stand-up double. He's going to swing away, hits it past the mound. Off the glove of the shortstop, and it rolls in the short center. Foscu is going to score. Roll over, and they've got him. They've kicked him off to end the ball game. What a great job by Cole Gordon. He was determined he was going to keep that guy close. Unusual ending, but a great win for the Bulldogs. And welcome here to what is a, a really uh, nasty day in, in Frisco, Texas. It is a day that is overcast. Uh, we have had a drizzle of rain falling throughout the afternoon. Nine in as long as it takes us. Just, just keep yourself focused and mentally in the game. All right? It doesn't matter. Elements, whatever, don't matter. Long pause on the one strike pitch. Ground ball back in the middle of the field. Shortstop will get to it behind the bag. Make a high throw. Throw it away. And coming around and going to score on the play is McNamee. A runner going, ball is hit towards a gap, right center field. That's got a chance to get between. Cut off by the right fielder. Going to try to score Rowdy Jordan, and he will score without a play. The cutoff man fell down. He slipped down with a baseball. Kick in the delivery and a swing and a miss, and that's going to be another strike. That's three strikeouts in a row. There's a ball, hit one hop shot, short stop, drops it, picks it up. He is safe at second base, and the run comes in to score. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out to end the inning. If that is the way he ends his outing tonight, it has been a superb one for JT Ginn. Jake Mangum waiting on a 3 1 pitch for the infield in and a runner at third, and he hits a ball in the air. Center fielder going over, makes the catch. Rowdy Jordan tags, heads for the plate. The throw will not be in time. Mangum does his job and drives in the run. The Bulldogs' lead is now two runs. It's coming. Fly ball, right field, should be easy. McNamee's there, and the Dogs have won two in Frisco. Mississippi State with a 4-2 win over Texas Tech.